my beloved, y'all. This is the first episode of Purpose Sisters Joy Rides. Woo! <laughs> y'all, I am so excited. Like, I'm on 10 this morning. Y'all, I am just so excited uh, to do this for a show. I'm, I'm just like in awe at how good God has been um, through all my entire life, but definitely over the last two years for the things that he has allowed me to do. I'm just like overjoyed. So I am on my way um, to pick up my first guest. And she is definitely the little sister that I did not ask for. I didn't know I needed. Y'all, I connected with this beautiful young lady like the second, the second I saw her, I was like, she is going to be in my life in some way, shape or form. Uh, we met um, during one of the classes that I lead at my church uh, called Starting Point. And ever since then, we have had a friendship and it just been absolutely amazing to see the growth um, in her over the last year and some. And y'all, she is a boss. Like When I tell you like she's a boss, she's a boss. She is a professional makeup artist. Um, she has her own travel club. Club. like this girl does everything like she's a fashionista I like y'all I'm obsessed I'm obsessed with her and so I'm going to go and you know find her and introduce you to my first guest <laughs> y'all and we're here we are we are here Wide blackout. Yeah, I know. Karma's on. And so I decided, you know, I was like, I'm going to get the little Starbucks and everything. And of course, Southwest Plaza completely. Dang it, a generator. No. Mm. In the, in, 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 mm. in the big plaza. So, anyway, Duncan saved the day. So I got you, uh, that's like a passion fruit refresher. Um, Lemonade Lemon. base. Yes. You decide drinking your own switch Yes, mine's is. What is mine? <laughs> no, that's dragon fruit. It's dragon fruit and strawberry. This is passion fruit and peach, but I let them put coconut okay. milk in it. Instead of bread. Instead of lemon. I knew it. Thank God. I, I was like, you know, what? I'm not gonna do that to her. I'm gonna make sure hers is like lemonade based because I'm just like that kind of like I would try it. And it was really, really like I'm gonna like it. Like it wasn't. It wasn't. Man, it's coconut milk. I lemonade. guess they only put a little tiny. I don't know. She weird. It ain't dairy. She weird. It, it ain't dairy. So I mean, it shouldn't cost my belly to stay. <laughs> Yeah, hopefully. Yeah, no, no. Hopefully. This tastes good, though. Not a coconut. Oh, girl. Ooh. Ooh. Okay, and then I did tell y'all, like, we, we actually driving on the streets in Nassau, so, Literally. you know, if, if y'all see us screaming, I just... Bit, just <laughs> that's a regular. Yeah. You know what I mean? Our people would understand that. That's just... They don't, it, they it don't is know, what it is. They don't know how to drive. Ex like, not... Mm -mm. I don't think I've ever driven anywhere as bad as Nassau. <laughs> Really? Like, I don't no, think honestly. so. Like, I feel, now, the only place I feel like I, I, I like, was terrified in driving was States. in California. I don't, because I don't, I don't know if they don't have turning signals or something. <laughs> like, it's, it's like, okay, one, two, three, you don't see no car, boom, like, and I'm like, okay, I, I feel like this is illegal. Like, yeah. something is wrong with this setup. But the, I think that was the only place I've been terrified. 
Of driving. Of driving. No. Miami just as bad as you. Like, it's just, it is what it is. You think so? I don't think so. What? I don't think so at all. I, no, I, probably because it's just straight roads. Okay, so you don't really be in Miami, in Miami then. Oh, you mean like true to Like true, true like true to ghetto. No, no, no. <laughs> oh, okay, be, because I can tell you now, it just, <laughs> just as bad. Yeah, no. As, Unle- unless the GPS, you know, the GPS is take you sometimes true to yeah, the trenches. And then he's got to come out. I, I, I know. Yeah, head. possibly that, but no. I don't, I don't know why, why was, like, I feel like I was fine to get on places. <laughs> <laughs> especially when I like, and especially when I by myself, <laughs> I, I don't, I don't get it. I, I don't understand. <sighs> no. I think my Google search has to be like on ghetto, mm-hmm. but you know it is what it the is. The roads here are just bad. The people just, <sighs> yeah, yeah, that. <laughs> so <laughs> I was like, okay, what am I gonna talk about today? And I knew that our topic could be nothing. N- nothing other than these dating <laughs> streets. <laughs> these dating streets. Yeah, repeat it. Say louder. Oh, these. <clears throat> these. Ain't even these. These. D E S E. These dating streets. I'm okay. Ooh. Every like y- y- y'all know me. I you know I talk about how um, I you know I'm I got divorced a few years ago and you know I've I've been trying to you know work my way back into the kitty side of the pool the dating scenes <sighs> but it has it been hot. Hot. <laughs> it has been horrible <laughs> I, it's been, it's and guess what and I'll tell anyone I feel like Dating when you in the world is one thing. Definitely. But, da- oh, Lord, I give my life to Jesus, and I say, Lord, I'm trying to go so down. I, and I'm like, oh, no, it ain't support. Girl, hold on, back it up. Ba- back it up. Because now the, the, the pickings are slimmer. Mm-hmm. Correct. And the ones who supposed to... <laughs> The ones who's supposed to be he safe. It's like they look warm. Let's just say that. They worse. They were, <laughs> they <get> worse. <laughs> and because okay, because when okay, let's say we 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 just re, we dating regular, right? Mm-hmm. We we know okay. We ain't really worried too much about purity. Definitely. We're not worrying about mm-hmm. whether or not they have a relationship with, with God. Mm-hmm. Um, we ain't worried about all of that kind of stuff. So we so expect the little drama, you know. You, we ain't expect a little baby off. mama somewhere mm-hmm. around. Mm-hmm. We expect those things mm-hmm. from regular men. I was like, you know, oh Lord, you know, well, yeah. The holes. It's, yeah, the it's, whole the whole it's, it's the holes. It's the holes. So, like, when I. I didn't envision myself ever being single at this point in my life, especially after getting married. And now finding myself back, you know, in this pool of, you know, in this pool. You know, I've been trying to like, you know, stick stick my little pinky in, you know, and see how the water feeling, but it ain't ain't feeling too good. Mm -mm. It ain't feeling too Mm -mm. good. And I'm like, Lord, this, this what you want from me? <laughs> like the longer, like the longer I go uh, being single, it's like, oh my lord, what you is you might as well just stay single. What is this? <laughs> what is this? And it's like when you, you know, we we talk about, worldly you know, dating. worldly dating. You know, where you don't really, you know, purity isn't a thing. You know, worrying mm-hmm. too much, whether or not they have a personal relationship mm-hmm. with God. Um, you don't care whether or not they really serving or anything like that. It's being your own desire. So yeah, you just you 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 doing your own thing, mm-hmm. you know. But when you decide, okay, I'm gonna I'm gonna do this God's way. After Jesus. <laughs> you know, it brings the amount uh, of options mm-hmm. down to this. <laughs> Close <it>. Okay, <laughs> that much. And 
But then you're still having the same issues. I know. It, it, that, like that you are, sense. that's that that what has baffled me. It, and I feel like it has be so much worse <laughs> because you expect them to know better. Like you really Christian? Like that, <laughs> is this, is this, that's where I'm at. <laughs> Like, like be the mopping, mopping. No, it's not. Something ain't adding up. It's, it's not. Who lying? <laughs> <laughs> like, like, I'm like, who lying? Because this ain't making <sighs> no sense. And sometimes it just make you feel like, okay, does it even make sense to go there? <laughs> no, but we ain't getting to that. But, like, you, you know, you, you know Mm-mm. that ultimately, you know, if it's God's will for us to be in relationship, mm-hmm. get married. Then you know, you know, he has somebody out there, mm-hmm. but it's like And in the and in the process of waiting, it's be another thing. So it's like um, this waiting. But I I feel I feel like they're out there. They are there. I think so. I they uh, are there. <laughs> 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 this world is big, Tracy. This world is very, very big. Mm. Maybe because I've been off the dating scene for at least, let's say, eight years. Yeah. Because I dated my ex, and then it was mine for five years. So I've been off the scene for like eight years. So like when I came... This is a baby. I don't even... So, <laughs> like, so when I came back... I was like, what, what, what in the ghetto was this? Mm. And then to add insult to injury, you're trying to date godly. Mm-hmm. And it's the... You're like, but we, we running into the same... <laughs> the same type of man. Stuff. Same, How? Same behaviors. Same behaviors. Which you would expect would be better because... They crushed it. Possibly. <laughs> They probably worse. <laughs> they worse. Y'all, but I've been single. I remember my date, January, no I lie, February 15th, last year. So I was a baby. <laughs> I was a baby to you. Oh, <laughs> so that's, so that's mm-hmm. like a year and that's some, some, yeah, some change. change. That's about it. And how has that been? <laughs> No, to be honest, I don't think I was I don't think I was looking for a relationship because I came out of that relationship and it was your hell. I think I needed my time alone. But it wasn't until like after I passed my year, I was like, all right, I feel a little lonely now. Mm. <laughs> I go on a little date here and there, but it's actually is actually worse. But the thing about about it is I think like when I was in the world, I had a lot, like, we had a lot of options. Yeah, you had a whole like, lot more options. we had a lot more options, but now nobody's even being my DM. Like, they don't even... <laughs> they, I don't even get asked on a date. No? <laughs> I took Tracy. I find that hard to believe. Tracy, I swear to you. <laughs> I don't even get asked on a date. <laughs> Isn't it a situation where, okay, because I've noticed in... In my little experiences that I've been having now, mm-hmm. I would have like spurts where sometimes you have a bunch of people trying to get your attention, and then other times it's like nothing. Like, oh God, did you put a paper bag over my head or something <laughs> like that? Like, I don't get, I don't understand it. Like, ain't nobody on my run. No. It's pe- like I had nothing, like zero. Still. So you probably like in a hidden seat. That, First that, of all, like you you hidden and I in in, in, in plain sight. sight. <laughs> in plain sight. Yeah. Because people that's, wouldn't think that. No. A lot of people don't. But reality is, I. Like I that don't have keep, That probably keeps you out of problems. It does. It probably keeps you out of a lot it of troubles. I find <laughs> it. It does. Like when I um, when I made up in my mind, I said, okay, I'm gonna do this God's way. I'm gonna. I'm going to do a vow of abstinence, mm-hmm. you know, and God, I ain't going to have sex with nobody until mm-hmm. I get married again and mm-hmm. don't let nobody dirty son <laughs> 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 with me. 
Judy Stone. And I don't think I, I think I underestimated just how hard, hard it was that was going to be. Mm-hmm. Like, I'm like, there have been times. There's not there have been times. There are times. <laughs> Because it'd be still in the process of that. Really? Where I have certain people mm-hmm. who I have put in my life to hold me accountable. Mm-hmm. Like, they have permission mm-hmm. to check me. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. And I'm talking about, it'll be like 11 o'clock in the night. And I got to call them. And I big this big listen. Y'all better come pray <sighs> with me. God, pray. Pray <laughs> with me. Warfare. Because... If this phone get in my hand, you know, and message the wrong person, we gonna have a problem. Uh, I could gonna see, have a no, problem. I can you and do it now because I literally just was saying that and I, I send a text. <laughs> then I tell my, then I tell him afterwards. Then I told him afterwards. So I was like, Lord, I just need y'all to come get the whole entire phone for me. Just get me. You know there'll be times when, when like, gotta be there, just turn it off. Yeah. Turn it off. Mm-hmm. Turn it, Tracy, just turn it off. That was me last time. <laughs> you know, they had they had this, um, it was a sermon um, by Transformation Church. Mm-hmm. This is like last year. Mm-hmm. A Pastor Tim Ross taught it. It was help, I'm horny. Mm. And he was like, you know the best way to get rid of that? <laughs> Speaking tongues. <laughs> He's like, when you get that feeling, <laughs> you have to try that. <laughs> Speaking of, <laughs> it's gonna go instantly. <laughs> and I've been doing that. For real? It mm-hmm. help? It's help. I gotta try that. <laughs> and, and because it's like, it, 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 get, it gets your mind mm-hmm. away mm-hmm. from it. You know? Because mm-hmm. it's. It's hard. Mm-hmm. It's hard, especially because like we, we desire a relationship, we desire <laughs> companionship. Um, I'm sure we want babies, you know. Thank God I have one, and and I I've been, you know, trying to figure out whether or not I was gonna have a next one from people born, because I feel like God gave me the wrong one first. <laughs> you know, Tracy. <laughs> you know, like I saw people. You some people get the calm child and oh, you you're like, the, you're like oh morning. like oh that's so nice and mm, calm and sweet and, and, sweet and I, I oh I get me <laughs> I got me I got the male version of me well you know what you're dealing with so I'm like but you think you can give me next one of them mm. but you know it is what it is but yeah it's oh, been like it's been it's been crazy I've had. So, but I'll call it any type of name. <laughs> the where the 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 um, I think the the worst one that I have experienced so far is I do minister like through TikTok and mm-hmm. all that stuff. Mm-hmm. Okay, so here I am minding my own business. This gentleman pops up on my TikTok. I'm talking to, you know, nice looking or whatever. Mm. I ain't paying attention. You know, you, you like and you comment mm-hmm. on the videos. It's mm-hmm. like nothing. Mm-hmm. I didn't. He DM you in. He slide in the DM. DM. <laughs> right? Uh-huh. Like a few hours after mm-hmm. I commented on the video. Mm-hmm. And it just happened to have been the day before my birthday. And he's like, did you have, do you have anything planned for your birthday? Mm. Da, 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 da. I'm like, no. And he was like, I want to take you out. I'm like, oh. Okay. And I was like, is this stranger danger? <laughs> <laughs> like, because, so I went and like I search up, y'all, like I all risky. Like I search, <laughs> like I search his videos and everything, oh, right? And as far as I can search, he's being man. Okay. You know, and he was doing the same thing I was doing. Mm. So I was like, maybe, you know. You might work, maybe. There ain't nothing wrong with a little date. A little outing. It was trashy. No. Robin. That was the best date I I've ever had. been on well, that's a good in day, my life. Tracy. Until he tried to like sleep with me like seven days later. <laughs> Yes. 
It lasted 10 days. That's long. That's <laughs> long. <laughs> we preach in <laughs> the gospel. <laughs> we preach in the gospel. I mean, but like, and he try, like, try. Like, try, try, try. try. Like, not even a kiss on the cheek. No, try. Like, try. Slowly. No. And his excuse was like, God, like, understand. <laughs> like, <laughs> what? And that's what that's I knew. Scare me, hey, that's like, what that's, I knew. That's, that's what is, that's what is scare me. And he was a trauma. I talking like six foot four. Like I, I why else be scamming people? <laughs> like why else be scamming people? Yeah. It's like that. Mm. It's like that. Yeah. But it's. But you see what a date? You know. <laughs> <laughs> so I, 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 I signed up for Tinder, right? <laughs> no, I'm laughing because I dare to. All right, y'all. So let's talk about this whole dating online. <laughs> y'all can comment below if y'all ever tried that. All right. So what you want, Tinder? Yeah. So she's on Tinder. I'm on Hinge. What's Hinge? Hinge is something like Tinder, but you can change your location. Mm. So like you you don't have to do that. Okay. I don't feel like my husband will be all. Okay. He's Makes gone. sense. Yeah. So you could you could actually change your location to wherever you want to go, and like it's way more options. Cause you're then set to. I've been getting all kind of different places. For real? Mm hmm. Oh, I but I. But how was the experience? I have signed up for Tinder three times in the last two years, and I have lasted a whopping 24 hours each time. It wasn't that bad for me. But let me tell you what I like to do. So I like to go on Hinge, like before I travel. So possibly I could maybe go on dates. <laughs> Possibly, maybe, you know, go on a little date here and there, but it it, it didn't work out. <laughs> let me tell you how bad, no, let me tell you how bad the Holy Spirit has convicted me because literally just last night, I go on it and literally I'd swipe left. Like next, no, next, next. And literally after four swipes, the Holy Spirit was like, come on your phone. <laughs> <laughs> like, yeah, yeah, finish. <laughs> Make me like put it down and it ain't making no sense. Like wait on me. I'd be like, okay. Yeah. All right. I prob I that's probably sense. that's probably why mine. This is like the way it is. <laughs> but now if I find someone who I am um, like like conversating with, mm -hmm. what I would do is before I log off Tinder and delete mm -hmm. the app, mm -hmm. I would either get their number. Mm -hmm. Or they get my number. Uh, or, or the Instagram, I see. Yeah. Oh. The, they can stay still reach you. <laughs> <laughs> what? I see scared. But it don't even, it literally, for example, there's one guy, he live in Miami. And I was like, all right, he seemed like a, you know, little Christian in his bio. <laughs> scripture. In his bio, God this, God that. I was like, all right, you know, let's exchange Instagram handles. And literally, like, the con like they don't know how to have a conversation, so the conversation is, it's just be you talking it. Let's yeah, be like, 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 all right. Yeah, it's a, it's a no. It's, it lasts a day, and then boom, you don't talk to each other no more. So I'm like, what's the point? What is the point of this? So what should we be looking for? Like, Oh, I knew that was going to come up. I knew that was going to come up. Anyway, you know what? Let's open the donuts. Y'all shout out to Dunkin' Donuts for being open today. I swear, because... Yeah, I got like, the box. Like, 
first of all, we go we're like, like we just going to we 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 go <laughs> to Costa Rica in a month. And we're supposed to be this would be the win. But you but know, she died and not. I ain't gonna lie. I don't know what the crap it is I doing at this moment in time. I really don't know. I like chocolate cake. I hate chocolate. Why? I don't have coconut on it. You weird. <laughs> <laughs> the fact that you have coconut milk in your drink, <laughs> I eat this chocolate. I'm an island gal. Like you know, let's talk about. Drinking coconut water out the out, out um out the coconut, I'd be like, "Wait, well, y'all trying to do that? Y'all know y'all could do that today." No. Like if, no, no, like no. if y'all wanted to, y'all could do that mm-hmm. today. It's a different experience when you're on vacation. Drinking coconut on the beach, I right or wrong. Literally. I do not care <laughs> about seeing no beach when I go on vacation. There have been very few places that I have witnessed where the beaches are as pretty as where we live. I haven't found a beach that's pretty I like them. Okay. Well. Philippines. I'm sorry. Mmm. Oh, that's far. Yeah. <laughs> it is. No, we have some good beaches, I'm gonna lie. We do. But, y'all go around me. Which we do. Occasionally. Which we do. A tad bit. So let's pivot. Mm-hmm. What do you do? I'm a singer, a songwriter. Songwriter. <laughs> um, okay, so you are whoever I am. Thank you. Thank you. Whoever you want to be. Thank you. I, I have to treat you like Daniel I'm right just... now. <laughs> the, 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 the world <laughs> is yours. <laughs> Whatever you want to be in this life, you can. So I am a makeup artist. You wanna look at my face now? Cause curl was off. <laughs> curl was off, but I had to show up and blame. A makeup artist and a travel planner, a singer, a dancer. That's about it. Oh, and she's a and she's a oh, PK. Wow. <laughs> Edit that out. <laughs> we gonna edit that out. Mm-hmm. So what got you into, like the traveling thing? Okay, because I travel a lot, and I said okay it'd be easier, because I tend to plan a trip like in two point five seconds. So because it's easy for me like that, I was like okay, why not let's turn this into a business. Because, you know, we have a lot of Bahamians down here who don't tend to explore mm-hmm. and like to travel a lot. So I was like, why don't I do like group trips? Because mm-hmm. a lot of persons, when they watch me travel, they tend to, oh my God, I want to come with you. And when's the next vacation? So I'm like, okay, why don't we turn this into a business? Get persons on board. You, you could leave your friends. Mm-hmm. You could leave your friends behind and hop on one of our trips. So that's basically. That was. It. That was what got yeah. my attention because mm-hmm. when you try to plan trips with your family <laughs> and your someone or like people just flake they like they flake. You had ten people and it's down to a strong two. <laughs> strong probably one. Okay. <laughs> probably. And it ends up one. <laughs> and you going away by yourself. <laughs> It so I was like, yeah, sense. when I saw, like, when I saw the fly, I was like, you know what, I am definitely doing that this year, because mm-hmm. I traveled twice last year by myself, mm-hmm. you know, and I'm like, but I'm not going to go far by myself. myself. Not yet. Not, if I'm going to go meet my husband in here, it going to have to be something waiting on me for me to <laughs> go, to go fly. <laughs> Thousands of miles away. There got to be something. Is either I doing a missionary trip, that too, or I getting married. That 
have to. You. Eat, eat all. That's fine. But it, but it is. I'm not. Mm. I'm not going all the way across the ro- the, ro- the world by myself. Your husband might be there. Yeah. He can bring me over there. Oh, you bring you. I ain't getting over there looking for him. What? <laughs> <laughs> he might find you. <laughs> <laughs> he finds a wife. Finds That's a good cool. thing. The wife come all the way. Y'all, no. <laughs> But people just ask me, oh my god, you travel so much and you don't meet no one yet. Like, it literally. That's because you be in the tourist area. <laughs> no, like, even at time, I don't know if, well, me, I like. It's recording. Mm-hmm. I like white guys as well. So it's like. <laughs> it's like we be there and I'll be sitting, like, alone and they would not approach at all. So I've had times where I used to go by myself while I traveling. And no one would approach me. I'm like, she's like, must be too What do you do? Do you sit to a like? Do you sit to the bar? No. Sometimes I sit to the bar. Like when I was sometimes I sit to the bar, or if I go to dinner, mm-hmm. stuff by myself, or like a lounge. But it's still the same thing. Like no one would approach at all. And I don't we're know. Gonna if... <laughs> <laughs> we're gonna put that to the test. We're gonna we're gonna put that to the test. Cause I noticed when I when I okay so. Only talking from here, mm-hmm. cause my my experiences in the state they've been a little weird. It's weird too. Yeah, they'd be a little weird. Mm-hmm. But normally, if I go out and I take myself on a date, mm-hmm. I like to sit at the bar, mm-hmm. even though I don't drink, mm-hmm. which it's is always like a topic of discussion. <laughs> really? Like me and the bartender <laughs> always having an argument <laughs> as to why this chick is ordering. A Coke lemonade. soda or a lemonade <laughs> and sitting in the bar. It it's like sense. you. I know. Have I. Have you ever heard of Jesus? <laughs> <laughs> like, I let you, Like, you know what? We might as well just turn this into a straight evangelism one time because you ain't let me live. <laughs> There's me shocked. Stunned. Why? <laughs> we back from our commercial break. <laughs> oh. You know, a brief intervention. Intervention, that's what that's what it is, right? That's the word. Intervention. Oh. But yeah. So definitely like I'm excited about the travel. I'm like I'm excited. I surprised you even catch on who better was. I am excited. Like I just wanna like because I've I've never been to Costa Rica. Yeah, me neither. So I am like so you never been to Costa Rica. So you never been to Costa Rica. Mm-hmm. This is the first time you plan a trip to Costa Rica. Oh, it's like we just as lost. Yeah. <laughs> ah, Jesus. <laughs> just as lost as y'all in the jungle. <laughs> I rather, I'd rather see, I'd rather see crocodiles and and dirty river water than than be on a beach. At least that's something I ain't used. To. Yeah, they be just seem pretty. It's black. Hey. It's literally black. Like the sand and stuff is black. The water is black. You can see it. Tread lightly before you go. <laughs> go no water. There are pools, so really nice, clean. <laughs> really clearly, nice clean pools. Clearly, so we about the chlorine it out. Yeah, definitely. Okay, yeah. that is fine. That mm. is fine. So now, <laughs> now that we've gotten all of that out of the way, well, we didn't talk about how did you get into makeup. Makeup is definitely not a passion for me. This was something that my passion is actually cooking. So I, I can kind of see that. Yeah, so that's actually my passion. I was actually supposed to be a chef at Bahama, and when we supposed to work, they did close. You know that time mm-hmm. we closed down, so we closed down. And then I did a makeup course. So when I did a makeup course, I started working for the makeup artist. And then when it was time to go to work to cook, I was like, mm, I already working, you know, making a little more money on mm-hmm. my own time schedule. I was like, I ain't too sure I won't go mm-hmm. work for people. So that was that. And it just stuck. Then I branched off, start my own business and call it a day. Which is doing very well. Just, yeah, it was just doing very, very well. <laughs> <laughs> but I love to cook though. Definitely love to cook. Yeah, one of these days we'll yeah. be able to sample one of our chef rolls dishes. You know, you tell me my chicken dry. <laughs> I can't. You know, you tell me 
my chicken dry and salty. <laughs> You think that's, so? That's one of my goals for me to open up a restaurant. Probably gonna get like 40. 45. That's my last goal. To open up a restaurant. To open up a restaurant. When I 50. 55. Just open it up just to run it. Just to run it. Because clearly, clearly it ain't gonna be for you to be cooking. When I, you know, retire from makeup and travel. Then I'll open up my restaurant, y'all. You know, at 32, I am like, yes, I'm 32. And I am just now trying to discover what I want to be like. I thought I knew. I thought I thought I thought I knew, but I'm at like I'm like at a transition uh like stage in my life. I'm like, I don't I love bacon. I love bacon. I don't know. Like, I went to YouTube from university. YouTube. You know? And, oh like, I did... <laughs> like, I didn't go to a class or nothing like that. Like, mm-hmm. it's just, like, That's something that... Pick, like, you pick up You, pick it, you mm-hmm. pick it up. That's how you know it's a gift from God. Mm-hmm. You pick it up, and it's been doing, like... Really good. Really good. Really good. I'm like, oh. Mm. Like, I... Yeah. Like, I can actually do something. <laughs> you know? Like, it's... It's, cra- it's crazy, but I feel like during this last two years, it has really been a transition for a lot of people. Mm-hmm. And I think if you, you know, if you actually took advantage of that downtime mm-hmm. that happened during the pandemic, there were so many businesses that were birthed um, out of that pandemic. And mm-hmm. guess what? A lot of them people did not go back to work. I'm pretty sure they no. they doing very well. Very very well. Very well. Very well. So I, lo- I love my pandemic baby. Mm-hmm. Like my business was definitely a pandemic mm-hmm. baby. You know, and hopefully it, it, it helps me in, in when I get married again. You know, I can make my husband some cupcakes. <laughs> cake. And they say a way to man's heart is through his stomach. Mm-hmm. You know, I may not be baking chicken. You baking when you- <laughs> It's okay. <laughs> it is, I used to, right? But I mean, you don't like doing no more. I don't, I don't even know if it's because I don't like it or what, but when I, if I have to cook for me, it could be serious. Like, if I have to, if I, if, if it could be me, if it's only me I worried about, it's probably going to be bought. Oh, it's gonna be a shame. Oh, you just buy plenty food. Like I, I, I buy. Or, oh, I am like I am so basic. Like I talking about, I buy sandwich stuff. You have an air fryer? Yes, I do. Why you? I, <laughs> why you don't use it, Tracy? Once every maybe four months or so, I may put chicken wings in it. I. My grocery list, when like outside of the things for uh, you my need son, to prep you for your is tur- turkey breast luncheon meat, <laughs> deli meat, cheese, bread, cheese, and spring mix. What is spring mix? Is Lettuce good? mix. I be eating sandwich every day. <laughs> Oh, that, that needed to be edited up. But anyhow, <laughs> no, no, no. like, it's like all the potentials. I am just, you know, like, right now, like, we just in that space, you know? Running a business, you got a toddler. I don't have the time <laughs> to cook. To, I just don't be but into you that. have an air fryer. You know what it is? To put a pork chop in the air fryer and you have food in two seconds? From, I have to go and clean the pork chop. Tracy, gonna clean and the And water. clean the chicken. Wings. I didn't, I didn't give up. Like, I just, I, I don't know. Moment of silence. <laughs> because. <laughs> it's, yes, I'm gonna get it, I'm gonna get it back. I think I've just probably just been on like a two year break, you know? Cause it's not that, you know, it's, 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 it's no, it's not. And then my, like my son is so, 
He's picky. at that top. He is very picky. He is very picky. This morning I got him to eat like literally almost like a bowl of grits for the first time in like two years. And he was so proud of himself. He's like, Mommy, I didn't eat bad food this morning. I had good food. And I'm like, I feel <laughs> like the best, the best <laughs> in the world right now because I got you to eat grits. <laughs> so, it's, <laughs> but that's just how it is. But as we wind down this conversation, <laughs> you gotta edit some of this stuff. As we wind down this conversation, you gotta edit a whole lot. I, Tracy, gotta edit some of this stuff. I'm so sorry. I'm sorry, y'all. <laughs> I warned my viewers, right? <laughs> when I was when I did the promo and I was like, y'all, oh, I like I graduated from like Bozo Academy. Ooh, I just like understand. like I just it is it is what it is. <laughs> it, I, is sorry. it is what it is, I'm you sorry, know. Y'all. So you know, we we out here single and mingling. I'm mingling. And it, <laughs> Do not. Don't try to contact this child. When I when no, maybe, like cause cause I about to, cause I'm about to go ask her her, her her handles right. I'm about to ask her socials where y'all can find her and book her for your trips and uh, for your makeup. But this is not Match.com. This is not Christian Mingle. So please do not message me and do not message her. Please, please. Hold on, and do not come in the DM and don't say, <laughs> say, God told me <laughs> that you were my wife. The, l- the last five people who tried to talk to me say that. The same day. God tell everybody that? I was like, well, who, why, why are you, you having all these that? conversations with me? Why are you having with these death? conversations <laughs> with me? And he having the, all these conversations. But how much, how much spirit of truths are there? I thought it was only one Holy Spirit. That has to be your first line. That has to be the first, the first line. But you know why? Because they believe, like, because you, um, they, they look at you, or she's in church, mm-hmm. um, that, you know, she is in that, she is in, into faith, mm-hmm. that we automatically out here just desperate for husband. And so they believe they'll be able to open the cookie jar when they say, God told me that you're going to be my wife. I literally told the last person, I was like, you and the last four people have said the exact same thing to me. And right now I'm trying to figure out if y'all delusional. Did you see even said I wasn't going to answer that? I just had to, I just like, no, I, I need you to know that ain't working. Stop doing it. If you want to ask me out, just, just, just ask me out. Don't even make this, is ha- and don't, this happened after we gone out, though. And they just wrecked the whole thing. Like, the last person I tried, like, the last person oh, I asked after me. after you all gone out, yeah, like the, mm-hmm. Like, the last person I talked to, like, within two weeks, he put a, a ring, ring on my finger. He put a ring. He put, he put a ring on my finger. He gave me the keys to his place. Like it was just, it was, it was, it was just, it was a whole ordeal. It was a. How you let's even get that far? I, 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 I know. I, 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 I feel like I had to been halfway with that. <laughs> Tracy. I like was just going along with the program <laughs> until I was like, oh, what the hell you doing? <laughs> um. I don't think that was it. Mm, you can have a like I don't think that was us. No. But it, my, listen, my my experience has definitely been colorful over this last um two years. I've I've had the privilege of meeting some nice people. Who have Where not do been? you go? Where do I go? To meet 
Honestly, but you say some of them is be online. Two have been online. Two? Yeah, two. And I, I two. Mm-hmm. The rest was in person. The rest were in person. Mm-hmm. Like one I met, um, because of my business. Mm-hmm. And you know all that. So it's like I'm like, I go to like Bahama, go sit in the bar. I go sunset. I was over in the back of the church, going. but anyway. <laughs> We go to the same church. I, two, two males. I bring my own to church. I bring my own to church. <laughs> this body for the church. But, rude, what is your, what, yeah, what are your socials? <laughs> uh, my socials are, you get it earlier. There we go. Life with Rizar. That's my personal page. And my business page is Rizar Beauty. It's a makeup page. And then my travel page is Rizar Travels. So you can click the link. <laughs> you can edit it. <laughs> you click the link. <laughs> click, click, click the handle right here, guys. Right here. Who tell you I know how to do handles? You don't know how to do that? Anyhow, <laughs> this has been, like, amazing. <laughs> so, y'all, this has been... <laughs> The first episode of Purpose Sisters Joy Ride. Oh, that was fun. Thank you so much you for come. your presence. You. It has been amazing. <laughs> oh Lord, we just getting started. Tune in next nope. week. Tune in next week. It was fun. <laughs> Bye. <laughs>